Aligarh Muslim University AMU is an Indian public central university. It was originally established by Sir Syed Ahmad Khan as Mohammedan Anglo-Oriental College in 1875. The Mohammedan Anglo-Oriental College became Aligarh Muslim University in 1920. The main campus of AMU is located in the city of Aligarh. Spread over 467.6 hectares, AMU offers more than 300 courses in both traditional and modern branches of education. In addition to this it has its three off-campus centers at Malappuram Kerala, Murshidabad West Bengal, and Kishanganj Bihar. The university comprises all castes, creeds, religions and genders, and is an institute of national importance provided under the seventh schedule of the constitution at its commencement. History Foundation It was established as Madrasatul Uloom Musulmanan e Hind in 1875. The college started on 24 May 1875. The Anglo-Indian statesman Syed Ahmad Khan founded the predecessor of AMU, the Mohammedan Anglo-Oriental College, in 1875 having already established two schools. The movement of Muslim awakening associated with Syed Ahmad Khan and MAO. College came to be known as Aligarh Movement. He considered competence in English and Western sciences necessary skills for maintaining Muslims' political influence, especially in northern India. Khan's image for the college was based on his visit to Oxford and Cambridge and he wanted to establish an education system similar to the British model. A committee was formed in the name of the foundation of a Muslim college and people were asked to fund generously. The seventh Nizam of Hyderabad, Hamir Osman Ali Khan made a remarkable donation of rupees 5 lakh to the institution in 1918. The then, Viceroy and Governor General of India Lord Northbrook gave a donation of 10,000 rupees and the Lieutenant Governor of the Northwestern Provinces contributed 1,000 rupees. Whereas, by March 1874 the fund for the college stood at 153,492 rupees and 8 annas. His Highness Sri Maharao Raja Mahamdar Singh Mahamdar Bahadur, GCSI, the late Maharaja of Patiala contributed 58,000 rupees. His Highness the Maharaja of Visyanagaram, KCSI also made donations. Shambhu Narayan, Raja of Benares donated 60 rupees. In the beginning, the college was affiliated with the University of Calcutta for the matriculate examination but became an affiliate of Allahabad University in 1885. In 1877, the school was raised to the college level and Lord Lytton laid the foundation stone of the college building. Transformation into university Around 1900 AD efforts began to make the college its own university. The Aligarh Muslim University Act of 1920 made it a central university. H. H. Sir Muhammad Ali Muhammad Khan and the Aga Khan III also played a major role in realizing the idea of Syed Ahmed Khan by collecting funds for building the Aligarh Muslim University in 1927. A school for the blind was established by Sahib Zada Aftab Ahmad Khan, and the following year, a medical school was attached to the university. By the end of the 1930s, the university had developed an engineering faculty. Syed Zafarul Hassan, joined the Aligarh Muslim University in early 1900s as Head of Philosophy Department, Dean Faculty of Arts. Movement <laughs> <laughs> Women's education Women's education started at the university with the establishment of the girls' school on 19 October 1906. The All India Mohammedan Educational Conference had started a movement to establish girls' education from 1896 onward. The school became Intermediate College in 1929 and on 1930 it was made a constituent college of the university and the name was changed to Women's College. Since then it caters to the female undergraduate students of the university. In late 2014 the university's vice chancellor Zamira Dean Shah turned down a demand by female students of the college to be allowed to use the Maulana Azad library which was male only. Shah stated that the issue was not one of discipline but of space as if girls were allowed in the library there would be 
four times more boys, putting a strain on the library's capacity. Although there was a separate library for the university's women's college, it was not as well stocked as the Maulana Azad Library. National Human Resource and Development Minister Smriti Irani decried Shah's defense as an insult to daughters. Responding to a petition filed by a Human Rights Law Network intern, the Allahabad High Court ruled in November 2014 that the university's ban on female students from using the main library was unconstitutional, and that accommodations must be made to facilitate student use regardless of gender. The High Court gave the university until 24 November 2014 to comply. Minority status Aligarh Muslim University claims itself as a minority institute guaranteed under Article 29 and 30 of the Constitution of India. However, Allahabad High Court has struck down provisions of Aligarh Muslim University Act stating that AMU is not a minority institution. In April 2016, the Indian government advised the court it would not appeal the decision. Organization The university's formal head is the chancellor, though this is a titular figure, not involved with the day-to-day -day running of the university. The chancellor is elected by the members of university court, a body with members drawn from all walks of life. The university's chief executive is the vice-chancellor, appointed by the President of India on the recommendation of the court. The court is the supreme governing body of the university and exercises all the powers of the university, not otherwise provided for by the Aligarh Muslim University Act, the statutes, the ordinances, and the regulations of the university. On the 11th of April 2015, Mafadil Saifuddin was elected chancellor, and Ibne Saeed Khan, the former Nawab of Chhatari State, pro chancellor. Habibur Rahman, former Vice Chancellor of Agra University, was elected Honorary Treasurer. On May 17, 2017, Tariq Mansour assumed his office as 39th Vice Chancellor of the University. Academic profile Aligarh Muslim University is a fully residential university having 13 faculties, 7 constituent colleges, 5 colleges academic programs, 15 centers, 3 institutes, 10 schools. Recently the university opened Faculty of International Studies. Topic rankings internationally, AMU was ranked 801, 1000 in the QS World University Rankings of 2018. The same rankings ranked it 238 in Asia and 161-170 among BRICS nations. It was ranked 601-800 in the world by the Times Higher Education World University Rankings of 2018, 158 in Asia and 157 among BRICS and emerging economies in 2017. It was ranked 17 in India overall by the National Institutional Ranking Framework in 2018, 10th among universities and 49 in the management ranking. Among engineering colleges, the Zakir Hussain College of Engineering and Technology, the Engineering College of the University, was ranked 17 by India Today in 2017 and 35 by the National Institutional Ranking Framework among engineering institutes in 2018. The Faculty of Law has ranked second in India by India Today in 2017. The Jawaharlal Nehru Medical College, the medical school of the university, has been ranked 8th by India Today in 2017. Libraries The Maulana Azad Library is the library of the university. It consists of a central library and over 100 departmental and college libraries. It houses royal decrees of Mughal emperors such as Babur, Akbar, and Shah Jahan, and are highlights of the collection. The foundation of the library was laid in 1877 at the time of establishment of the Mohammedan Anglo Oriental College by Lord Robert Bulwer Lytton, 1st Earl of Lytton, the then Viceroy of India, and it was named after him as Lytton Library. The present seven storied building was inaugurated by Jawaharlal Nehru, the first Prime Minister of Independent India in 1960, and the library was named after Abul Kalam Azad. Azad, popularly known as Maulana Azad, the first education minister of the independent India, the Social Science Cyber Library was inaugurated by Pranab Mukherjee, the President of India on 27 December 2013. 
In 2015 the Cybrary was accredited with the International Standard Organization Certification and in October 2016 registered in LIMCA Book of Records. <laughs> <laughs> Student life Aligarh Muslim University Students Union Aligarh Muslim University Students Backquote Union or AMUSU is the university-wide representative body for students at the university. Traditions Sherwani is worn by male students of the university and is a traditional attire of the university. It is required to be worn during official programs. The university provides Sherwani at a subsidized price. Sherwani is a unique tradition of Aligarh Muslim University. In early 2013, Zamir Adin Shah came into prominence by insisting that male students have to wear Sherwani if they wanted to meet him. Clubs and societies Sports and cultural activities are executed by various clubs available in the campus. Notable ones include the Oldest, Cricket Club, Horse Riding Club, and AMU Drama Club. Old Boys Association Old Boys Association was established in the year 1898. It has been statue in AMU, Act 1920. Topic: Notable alumni. Throughout its history, a sizable number of university alumni, popularly known as Alegs, have become notable in many varied fields, both academic and otherwise, ranging from Zakir Hussain, third president of India, Pashtun independence activist Khan Abdul Ghaffar Khan, the former vice president of India Muhammad Hamid Ansari, Andre Weil, the French mathematician of the 20th century, and Wara Tamer I, and the only woman to be the chief minister of Assam. Sheikh Abdullah, and Mufti Muhammad Sayyid both former chief ministers of Jammu and Kashmir, sportspersons like Dayan Chand, Lala Amarnath and Zafar Iqbal are some among the many alumni of the university. <laughs> <laughs> university in literature and other media The Aligarh Muslim University is the setting for numerous works of fiction. Films set in the university include Mir Mehboob, a 1963 film directed by H. S. Rawil and starring Rajendra Kumar, Sadhana, Ashok Kumar, Nimi, Pran, Johnny Walker and Amita. The 1966 film Nai Umar Ki Nai Fossil was also filmed on the campus. Aligarh 2015, a film on Ramchandra Sir as a gay professor from the university, has been released and received a warm response worldwide. 